getting the children all an email address that's something that's been on my list of things to do for absolutely ages but again there's been a bit of resistance people didn't really see the point um i'd really enjoyed using tapestry with the yfs and there had been talk about extending that well before we knew about any of this because i like the idea of parents having that real up close personal journey with the learn uh, access to the learning journey and seeing that evidence and that's what I like so much about the seesaw, the fact that we can really get parents to um, participate in that and see that and see those photos, see that um, writing, see everything um, much more easily. Um, though we have a brilliant open door policy and parents before COVID were in and out classrooms of all year groups. Every afternoon after school, they could come in and look through books and chat. And um, that was a very great thing. And um, we missed that. Um, it would be a way of definitely um, kind of keeping that going. So yeah, there are things technically wise, IT wise, that I wish were in place. I wish we had um, got the internet sorted, but that really isn't anyone's fault. And we're going around in circles with that. We've had a whole two days at a time when we had no internet in school at all. Both the school's internet is, can be really unreliable and that is super frustrating, but I don't think it's even money um, particularly, it's just um, to do with um, the, the structure and the, how far we are from the, the, the fibre boxes and how long the line has to come down and by the time it gets to us it's pretty useless. <laughs>